Yo, what is going on everyone? In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can unlock the horse in Elden Ring or the Spectral Steed. Now, this item is definitely going to make the game a lot better when you can traverse around the map three times as fast. So I'm going to show you guys how you can actually unlock this item basically right away after starting your campaign. Now, the best thing about this is that you can actually fight from this speed as well, making some of the fights a little bit easier as you can get away from the enemies and use more of a range attack on them. So I definitely suggest going out to get this as soon as you can. So in order to get started, what you probably want to do is actually come over to a specific location that's called the Gatefront Ruins. Now the Gatefront Ruins are a little bit ways away from where you start out, but it's only a few minutes of a walk. I'll show you guys how you can actually get there from the start of your game. So if you're just starting out your campaign, you can actually go directly to this location and unlock the horse right away. So if you haven't done this yet, just fast travel to Limgrave, or if you're just starting out, this is where you'll be. From here, you just need to go on a small run over to the Gatefront Ruins, and I'll show you guys how to get there from basically right where you start the game out. Now you will see this uh, small boss fight here. You can take him out if you want to, but you don't actually have to straight away. You can come back later once you get a little bit stronger. So just run past him if he's still here for you. Once you get past him, there will be this building on the left, and there's actually a save point here as well. You want to go ahead and unlock that so that you can fast travel back here as well later on. It's also going to make it so you respawn here if you die. So go ahead and use that, rest there, then you can come run along this pathway. Just keep running through these woods and you'll see a couple enemies in front of you that you could also take out if you want to. But just to make the video faster, we're going to run right through it so I can show you guys exactly where this is. So just keep running on through and eventually you're actually going to see two more resting points. Once you actually activate these resting points, a cutscene should begin and it will actually start and unlock the horse for you. So we're almost there actually, you just keep running over this hill and you should see a small town here. Now there's a bunch of enemies in that town so I, you don't want to really run straight in there just yet if you're just trying to unlock the horse. Instead come over here to the left, you're going to see a, another one of those checkpoints you can use. And if you use this checkpoint, which should start the cutscene for the horse, which is going to be pretty sick to unlock that as fast as you guys can. So just simply come over to this resting point and make sure to actually rest here and as soon as you do it will trigger the cutscene. So I'll let you guys take a look at that. After the cutscene just accept the person's offer and it will actually unlock the horse for you. Greetings, traveler from beyond the fog. I am Melina. I offer you an accord. Have you heard of the Finger Maidens? They serve the Two Fingers, offering guidance and aid to the Tarnished. But you, I am afraid, are maidenless. I can play the role of Maiden, turning runes into strength to aid you in your search for the Elden Ring. You need only take me with you to the foot of the Erd Tree. So that's pretty much it for this one. Once you guys accept everything, you will actually be granted the whistle and you can then use the whistle at just about any time in a quick menu by holding triangle and you will be able to actually summon the horse pretty much whenever you want. The cool thing is, is you can actually use it in battle as well and that's pretty much it for this one guys hopefully it helps you guys out i wanted to make this video show you guys how to unlock the horse and that's pretty much it so hopefully it helps you out if it did be sure to drop a like down below and i will catch you guys in the next one peace